Alright, so I guess we can just keep going with this. Despite the fact that we're in the same place again. Yeah. I'm I'm perfectly fine actually with just doing <laughs> this part again. I just need to take a break from that, because that was just like it was getting played that one time. And uh oh the cave again. I think you talked about this. This is that's right. Uh <laughs> I like the sound effects very much. And the boot. I'm surprised that these. Oh, right. You have to actually do this. I had to slide into some of the other guys. Is he not gonna? Okay, whatever. <laughs> Don't make invincible enemies if they're just gonna get bumped off and so weak. <laughs> so I guess while we're doing this again, the stars. I kind of noticed those. I don't really know the point of them yet, though. It's um. Add replay value, I guess? Yeah, I think so. There's only so much you can do with Flash games. Yeah. Um, but you know. Whatever. Oh! Oh, oh he Sparta kicked me off. I hate those. Interestingly enough, I keep saying Sparta kick, and I don't think I've seen 300 in its entirety. I've seen parts of it, uh, which will. Th this will probably make everyone lose respect for me, but you know. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! Ah! Fall. Yes, I do uh, fall. You should. It shouldn't happen. Seeing as I love platformers more than just about anything else, or any game any other. Yeah, game wise, <laughs> or any other genre, I should say. Adam, Adam, I love you more than platformers. Okay, I'm glad to hear that. <laughs> oh goodness, does that do anything? Create combos? No. You're gonna need. Um, or I could just ignore him. Does his hair blow back when yep. he does that? Whoa! Okay, you it's pretty. It's pretty. Oh, there we go. Er, I I must break you. Yuri. Yuri. It's Boris. It's Boris. It's Boris. Hello. Golden. Is that is that your? F it, I don't know. That might still be my favorite James Bond movie. Uh, is uh is Golden Eye. I mean, I, I know that, like, of course, there's the video game associated with it, and that's typically what people go with. It, it's better not, like, knock me off again. It's not. It just gives me a lot more health. Like, way more than I even need. Um, Considering that you have health and lives. Yes. And pants, then. Oh, and I, pants. I am sorry. So, um... I guess I guess the one really important thing will be not to die in that same room as we did before, or else we do this thing a third time. And at that point, I almost feel like editing stuff out for third time. For third time, when I killed myself for third time. I don't think that's possible. Uh, not unless you're a video game character, and that's why the concept of YOLO doesn't doesn't apply to video game characters. And shouldn't apply to anything else. That's your editorial. That's my that's my cultural synapsis, I I think. That's appropriate, right? So many trees or more like drawings. When you actually I guess really want to scrutinize it, it doesn't really look that great. But uh I'm not gonna scrutinize it because I mean, some some things in this game look absolutely fantastic, so... There you go. Jump. We're gonna... Oh! Uh, I was... I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do that now, not all it's going away. Go. My instincts tell me that that is a very bad idea. Can we do this? Oh, okay. I'm assuming yes, I don't have to do anything. A new hole. Oh, that that. Okay, that looks nice. By contrast, like the whole like different layers of presentation. And that. back into the cave. Oh mm -hmm. wait, no. This is the cave. I talked about this before, right? This box. Uh. I made this in a cave. The box. box of scraps. And that's an Iron Man. That's not. <clears throat> we we could make take track 
Okay. You, you only have to do that for references I'm pretty confident no one will ever heard of. Well, which are many, I'll admit, but, um... Not, might not remember that line from Iron Man as well as us. Yeah, it's true. It's, it's very... I think it's very funny, personally. Uh, I, I think we can just drop down here. I was gonna go for that star, and, you know, I realized I really don't care. So... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well... I'm certainly not, probably not gonna make another one where I go look for more, so... There, oh! That is a... I just get a, a book. book? A beard? Is that, like, beard killing things? Oh, right, they just drop you right back into here. Right, yeah, I, I need to make sure not to die. I think it's just Book of Bearded Knowledge or something. Oh, there we go. This is fun. This is fun. Like, just don't take damage. That's true, I should probably just run, sort of. Oh, like that, you mean? Don't do that? I'm sorry. Oh! Actually, I'm not taking damage. Adam? Yeah. I'm keeping score, so thank you. For all the people keeping score at home, I thank you. Oh, wow. That was way more dangerous. <laughs> oh, right, I don't have to do any of that. I can just run along the ground here. I feel like it's getting really laggy with all these guys floating around. And all you. Dying. I know. Oh, I can just hop on top of them? Apparently. Apparently they're pretty bad. Oh! Oh, this is not helpful. Okay. Wow, yeah, there's a lot of them now. Yeah, you're gonna have to, uh, get out of there. I'm gonna need to do some, I'm gonna need to, like, slide into a bunch of them. Wow, wow, wow. Oh. There's too many of them. It's like it's like the one scene in Matrix Reloaded with all the Smiths. Well, I think we're actually looking pretty good now. Ninjas everywhere. Press up to advance. Also pirates hate ninjas. Have been keeping them away this whole time. <laughs> Some nasty little things. Oh, I just have to kill them. Whoa! I hadn't seen this before. Yar! I feel like a new pirate. Now my first order of business as Captain Manly Beard. Oh, is this his rainbow beard? I, I, I guess. Helping him out? I guess not. I shall provide my newfound manly might by giving ye a thoroughly beard stomping or something. I didn't read it. I don't really care. It's only about evil little girls and. Can I go home now? Oh. Oh, do I, have to, do I have to hit him? Oh! Well, I did not predict that that would happen. <laughs> What are we doing? I don't. Oh, now he is nin ninjas. I guess. I guess that that's something I can have. I guess I. Okay, I guess that I need to not do the same stupid things yeah. continually. And not like time. Oh goodness! Oh no! Right, like the bosses would do. And there we go. I hope this 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 boss is about as easy as the first one. Oh, about five hits, you think? Oh, yeah, wow. that's my guess. Any other wagers? Oh, okay. He tried attacking me despite the fact that I wasn't even on the ground. If that's if that's it, oh, seriously. Game. <laughs> okay. On the. <laughs> You're a horse now. I'm a horse now. Is that oh. all? That's game. Is that? Is that seriously the game? I think so. Okay. Oh, it's a off to the side. It does say game completed. I wish I could um shift over there, but according to Congregate, that was that was the rest of the okay. game. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> um, Ooh, ten minutes left. That wasn't even like a menacing boss battle. It was <laughs> four hits, an even number. I think it was. I, I I thought it was three. We can go back and count, but. Well, um, Whatever. I guess it's, anyone it was watching an easy this boss. can review our, um, counting review skills. Review our counting skills. <laughs> I'm not going to go back and check and, like, put it in, the, in editing, so, because I think that that's the sort of quality that people expect about now. But, um, okay, so that's, that was uh, Fancy Pants Adventures World 
three. Um, and I think the last one is Series Three. That is the last one in the series so far. I believe that they're that they're going to try to make one for like Xbox Live Arcade, which a lot of times they do as a result of the uh, Flash games. So I guess w what we can do is say what we thought of the entire series. Yeah. Um. I think this is a pretty good platformer. Um, yeah. Lots of uh. They had some interesting things at the end, like pencil was pretty cool. <laughs> the, um... I still know how to do tornadoes. Oh! There I got go. it. Okay, what you do? <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> De derailing our, our commentary for a bit. You start out by winding up. You press down, and then you release down and press up or. Uh, Dang it! Um, of course, I can't repeat it. Oh yeah, there you go. You have to you, you push down to start out with, and then you pu push up um, while you're in the middle of the swing. So that's cool. That is pretty sweet. Um, so pretty good mechanics in this last one. But yeah, back to the series. Like the sword fighting mechanic. And, uh, Unfortunately, it only showed up in the third game. Yeah, yeah, it would have been nice if that was like all the games, but mm -hmm. nice that it was included in the last and by far the longest game. Oh yeah, um, wow. The first one really seemed like a proof of concept, a very good one at that. Um, and he decided to like throw in like little little things like wall jumping too, but definitely not a complete game. Like there wasn't sliding, wall jumping was optional. Basically the process of going into later games gave you more features and I thought that really yeah, made the game stronger. The game improved as it went along. Yeah. Um also the bosses were probably too easy. But um On um, the second <laughs> boss well actually you know what? Based based on how <laughs> how we showed it off to be the second boss is not aggravatingly difficult. I don't think I died once. When when before like I had to go through about like five lives for um beating him because it, it can be tricky. That was the trickiest of all of them. I was shocked at how easy the third one was though. I think he'd ramp it up a little. Um, and of course this game is filled with style and fanciness and headbanging. This humor, things like that. You'll find a lot of that on uh, in a lot of uh, Flash games, too. Just like this humor aspect to it, which can be quite funny at times, or just silly, because you give yourself a rainbow bearded pirate. Um, <laughs> so, you know, whatever. This is like the third time I've just seen him puff out his hair, because he's just been talking this whole time. Uh, any, other, any other thoughts about the series? No, not really. Um, I mean, I, I've been pointing this out the whole time, but probably, uh, almost, if, if I had to say, like, the best part of this game is the animations that they give for it, and I'm kind of showing some of them off now. Those also improved as, as the game went along, and as there were more mechanics, because some of the mechanics they really had were good. Um, I liked I liked the more straightforward approach to the game in the first and second games, actually. If there's anything, anyone where World 3 fell short, it was that they felt like they need to teach you too much, I thought. Like, they have this, they have the, the, the tutorial stage, and then, like, in-game pop-ups. I mean, we know. We we know about Flash games. You probably don't need to give us tutorials about those. But, um, really, really only major flaw. It wasn't... I've seen better platformers, but not many. Not, uh, I mean, let me rephrase that. I've seen better Flash game platforms, but not many. And um, I feel I felt like this was a good place to start. Um, so yeah, I think that's everything. Yeah, that's that's all. Uh, after one bit of rage, which didn't even end up being that bad, because then um, we finished the game in like ten more minutes. Uh, I <laughs> held off for weeks on that though. We could do a little better. It's kind of when we feel like it. <laughs> yeah. All right, so um. I guess that's it, guys, for the Fancy Pants Adventure series. Uh, it's not it for Epic Flash time, though. Check out from, uh, look, stay tuned for some more of that. So uh, until next time, this has been ZZ Place. I'm Chris, yeah. and we'll see all you guys around. Stop doing that.